All right, Stan, this is the house, 3308 Alcudia Bay. Um, this is the front of the house, three-car garage. There's your garage. Um, these are your neighbors. This is a cul-de-sac. It goes there. Uh, the street behind that wall is uh, industrial, or better known now as uh, Dean Martin Way. Um, that house in the corner there is for sale. That's a 2,300 square feet. Um, again, this is your neighbors. Um, it looks like everybody here has a three-car garage. We're going to get in the sunlight. I should have an auto fader, I think. Yep, okay. Um, hopefully that sunlight... There it goes. Use my hands. Um, this is the street out. Uh, notice all the lush vegetation. And we get a glimpse of my car. And here is the unit, 3308 Alcudia Bay. Um, we'll take a walk to the front. Desert landscaping. Oops, a little faster. And this is the front entrance. Um, you have to allow me to get the lockbox key. Uh, this, yep, hold on one minute. Vicky, you want to say hi? <laughs> There you go. There she is. Okay. <laughs> and back to the inside of the house now that the door is open. This is the um, front living room. There's a doggy door there. Um, the front living room. It does have plantation shutters, uh, vaulted ceilings, uh, ceiling fan. This is basically the combination of a dining room and a front living room. Oh, I can't back out anymore on this. Okay, so it's going to be very up and close, I guess. Um, I guess they made this the living room where there's a TV in here. Um, pot shelves. This is your coat closet. And now we're going to walk on to the family room in the kitchen, separated by a small pony wall. Um, this is the kitchen. Let me walk around here. This is the kitchen. Nice cabinets with crown molding. Again, the high ceilings. Um, we've got uh, the pot shelves again. Um, welcome to the desert. <laughs> uh, recessed lighting, plantation shutters, granite countertops. Looks like they got the accessories on the uh, cabinets also. Um, I, uh, let's see, some stainless uh, accessories also. Um, this is the sliding glass door to the backyard, kind of the bay window style. Um, also the family room with uh, some plantation shutters, ceiling fan, vaulted ceilings, um, also a fireplace. This is the pony wall. Oh, there's my business card. Cool. Let's zoom in on that thing. Hey, we know that guy. <laughs> All right. Um, fireplace. This is the family room. And let's see. There's the fireplace. The entertainment niche or uh, media niche and looking back out towards the front of the house the living room uh, anyhow let's go to the backyard now so oh yeah here's the pot shelves um, let's see yep and it looks like there's a little working desk here if uh, you know you want to write checks while you're cooking dinner or what have you um, let's see, let's open the, let me shut this off while I open the, um, plantation shutters. Um, hey Vicky, do you mind closing the front door? Oh, yeah. I think the wind oh. is, yeah, thank you. Yeah, this, ooh, <laughs> I guess the wind beat you to it. <laughs> yeah, no worries, uh, this is the backyard through the, uh, bay window plantation shutter, uh, dining niche there. Um, this is the backyard. It's not very deep. Uh, probably about, uh, it's about 15 to 18 feet deep. Um, looks like I'm gonna run out of disc also. It says five minutes. Uh, your backyard neighbors are a little bit lower compared to uh, where we're standing. Um, it is a covered patio with some wiring. Uh, there is recessed lighting if you look on top. 
Uh, I think this one is out for some reason. Um, sliding glass door at the master bedroom also. Uh, this is the backyard. Uh, there's also a dog run off by the master bedroom. Okay. Cool, so we got the backyard. We'll meet you back inside. All right, and we're back, and we're going towards the master bedroom. Again, that's the uh, front living room, dining area. And this is the hallway. Uh, a small plant shelf there, built in, I guess, with uh, pot shelves. And this is the hallway. And I, I guess uh, look, one more look at the uh, family room and where we came from, from the backyard, the little breakfast nook there. Uh, okay, let's go to the master bedroom. Ah, small little uh, alcove here. Um, yep, cabinets. Uh, your friendly realtor there. <laughs> and now into the master bedroom. Let's see. The master bedroom this is a pretty good size. They, it looks like they have a king size bed in here. Um, it is painted a little bit of an olive type green. Um, there's a closet on this side. I don't believe it's walk-in. It doesn't look like it's very deep. Uh, let's see, pot shelves on top of that. And let's see, sliding glass door there to the backyard again. With the plantation shutters. Um, very nice uh, entryway to the master bathroom with uh, separate tub, separate shower. Um, double sink, his and her sink. I believe those are adult height cabinets. Um, let's see, here's the bathtub. Uh, windows with regular blinds, not the shutters. And um, the stand-up shower. Very, very clean. Uh, seems to be in very good condition. Uh, more pot shelves up there for your decorations. Um, the water closet very very good condition and this is the walk-in closet so there's two closets essentially uh, one upon entry and this one I believe is a walk-in a little on the dark side um, there, oh there is a light in there I don't know where the light switch is but that's alright I think we can cap capture most of that so yep this is the walk-in closet kind of a triangular shape uh, if we look inside um, yep just regular uh, walk-in closet. A little dark on the inside. So, anyways, that is the walk-in closet. Let me close that mirror up. And now we'll go back out. Okay. So this is the master bedroom. Um, nice green paint. Uh, pot shelves again up there. Uh, and this is the hallway to the secondary bedroom. There's a total of four bedrooms, including the master. Um, to the right is where, where we came from. And now this is the secondary bathroom. Two sinks as well. So in case you guys do have two or more children, they can uh, definitely sh share the bathroom at one time with the two sinks. Uh, Stand-up shower and tub combination. Uh, let's see, and as we go this way, right across from that was the secondary bedroom. We'll call it secondary bedroom number one. Uh, the way they have that set up is, I guess, it's a workout room. Um, ceiling fan is there, vaulted ceilings. Oh, nope, high ceilings, volume ceilings. Um, does have a closet with sliding door. It's not a walk-in. Um, all of these have lever handles, um, raised cabinet or raised cabinet, raised panel doors, even on the closet doors. Um, let's see. And then we have this is a small linen closet, I do believe. Let's see what it is. It is a small linen closet. And let's see, as we go down here, this is bedroom, secondary bedroom number two. Uh, looks like we're running out of tape. I uh, might have to continue it, or DVD, I should say. This is their office, I guess. Uh, again, another closet there. This one here is the laundry room. Um, let me open it real fast before we get to secondary bedroom number three. Um, they have a stackable washer dryer, looks like a refrigerator here, and that's access to the garage, which I'll probably catch on a separate DVD. 
Um, this here is secondary bedroom number three. So a total of four bedrooms now. Um, it is often an angle right by the front door entry where we came from. And it does have a uh, sliding glass, sliding door closet. Not a walk-in pot shelves in here.